So first we're gonna put a little bit. There's a lot left. Let's let's might as well put a lot like this much, and then we're gonna pour water out room temperature water. Put this away, and let's do it. Let's see what happens. Fill it up all the way to the top. See what happens. Wow, this is cool stuff, yo. This feels so awesome. Comment below what do you think? Look how much it is. And you see there is no more water. It's up. And this paper, and this is where you got little metal over here. Alright, we're gonna do different experiment. I got the different butter right here. We're actually just gonna take a small piece and throw it in water, see what happens. Actually boils. Now we're gonna try something different. Try to burn it, small piece. Whoa. All right, main thing that you're gonna need is aluminum foil, but not aluminum foil where you cook. It's from the gum, you know what I mean? You get this ones from the gum. So I saved couple from the last experiment. Hope you remember what experiment it was. So what we're gonna do is put the match like that on a edge and just sew it up tightly. Very very tightly, you know what I mean? As tight as you can. That's what she said, right? Or he. Alright, whatever. Tie it up and then you flip it like that. And fold it, I mean. And you got this kind of match with the aluminum foil like that, you see? So then we're gonna, I'm gonna put a plate and put it right here. Let's see how far will it shoot. Remember, fire extinguisher, do not try this at home, very dangerous. I'm gonna use my lighter. Yep, you guys seen it? There's a lot of smoke, that's why you shouldn't do it at home. Anyways, we're gonna get our neonium magnet and attach it to the negative side of AA battery. Then we're gonna grab our couple wire. Alright, and then put the couple wire over like this in the middle and let it go. Let's see what happens. Look, it's just speeding up, huh? Let's see how fast it can go before it's gonna fall off. Is that awesome? So check it out, it's very easy. Make sure your lid is pretty tight and just start twisting it. Just twist it. Don't worry, it's not gonna explode in your hand. And guess what? We got vacuum in there. But then we're gonna and twist it over here. Check it out. So I got a small piece of a steel wolf and all we're gonna need is touch it like that. Let's see. And put a cotton ball on top. Sometimes open it like that makes it easier. Alright, check this out. And we got a fire already. You see the cotton bond, cotton balls are on fire. What do you guys think? If you blow it, it's gonna go even faster.
Yep, that's pretty much it. Start the fire with the cotton balls, steel wool and a butter. And you see we have a fire. Once you touch it, you see how easy it burns. Tell me in comments how is that happening scientifically. Once I touch it, it's burnt. What does this steel wool have that when you touch it, it gets on fire like this? You know what I mean? Let me know if you think it's useful in a zombie apocalypse situation. I think it would be. And as always, don't forget to subscribe and I'll it's, see you next. Uh, the next step is hang these two weights like that on top of this thing. Alright, check it out. I got this thing tied up to this chair going all the way to this chair, tied up to this chair. And in the middle I got these two strings tied up to the this thing and it's gonna go down and we got two weights over here a really cool experiment like physics experiment we're gonna back up so we can see everything and you see these two weights are at the same level just hanging over there no, no movements almost and I'm gonna grab one of these weights and let it go let's see what happens while this one's spinning it stops and this one's starting to spin like that. And guess what happens? Magic or science. Science magic. This one's stopping and this one's starting to spin. Look how fast it's spinning. Light, light it up and put the cornstarch in your uh, mouth and blow on it. Alright, I'm gonna do it again and turn off the light. Let's see what happens. First I'm gonna light the stain up, the torch. So check out what I did here. I got a wire, any kind of wire and just wrapped it around of a nail just I'm just gonna do it one more time like that and I did it with a bunch of them exactly six and then you're gonna do in this kind of order nail copper nail copper nail copper nail copper nail copper and again nail and copper on this side so at the end you're gonna end it up on this side is nail and on this one said is copper and let's just start our LED lights and see if it's gonna make any energy let me turn off the lights I got here a bunch of different colors of LED and let's stick it in if it doesn't work other side here's the blue you see it works let's start the other one I know all it is is just vinegar 